After recent serious accidents involving dirt bikes in Baltimore, some city leaders are moving forward with plans to build a dirt bike park. Amy Yancey with where the plan stands now. Marcus, the goal is to remove the stigma of dirt bikes by giving riders a legal place to go right here in Baltimore. Dirt bike riders blowing through Baltimore streets, weaving in and out of traffic, a common sight during warmer months. Three people, including Karee Smith and Allison Blanding, killed in 2015 and several hurt in dirt bike crashes this year. That's why some city leaders are moving ahead with their plan for a dirt bike park in Baltimore. It gives them an outlet, another recreation facility for what is being vilified to devilify it. Dirt bike riding on Baltimore City streets is illegal and some say dangerous for pedestrians, other motorists, and the riders themselves. Last summer, city police spearheading a crackdown in northwest Baltimore. Council members Pete Welch and Carl Stokes heading out to Hanover, Pennsylvania to visit two dirt bike clubs to get design ideas. Supporters say skateboarding was once seen as a threat to public safety as well, but the city eventually built parks like this one for riders. They want the same for dirt bikes. Some kids want to have a, a safe place to ride without being chased, harassed, any type of threats whatsoever. We want to make this happen in a way that's safe, wholesome, and, and legal. City police not initiating a park, but open to the idea. Any alternative uh, to, to being on the streets where pedestrian and vehicular traffic is, is something that we're going to pay close attention to. Something many are paying attention to following Ravens player Trey Walker's death in a dirt bike crash this week. And this is exactly what we don't want to happen here in Baltimore. And the council members say they are not worried that this park could potentially increase the number of stolen dirt bikes in Baltimore. Amy NCWJZ Eyewitness News. Back to you. Councilman Welsh says he plans to reach out to the Ravens organization about naming the dirt bike park after Trey Walker as a tribute.